Welcome back and congratulations on your progression through the course. Unit 2 challenged you to reflect upon your knowledge of the hardware and software involved in management information systems and the difference between application software and operating systems. As you saw in Unit 2, hardware and software depend on one another in order to function properly. You learned some of the history and development of networking technologies and the importance of broadband technologies in organizational networking. In Unit 3, you will learn what metadata is, the difference between data, information, and knowledge, how to create a database, the purpose of a database management system, what a data warehouse is, the role of data mining in an organization, and the components of knowledge management. This unit begins with a couple of videos about the DIKW pyramid and the difference between data, information, knowledge, and wisdom. You will learn how each differs and builds upon one another. Some of the key concepts to watch for in Unit 3 are how you can use data to drive your decisions and the key role information technology plays in knowledge management. As before, remember to continue to take notes. They will help you not only with the unit assessment and the final exam, but help you to build connections between each unit of this course. Good luck, and we'll see you here before Unit 4.